Okay, so, um, hello everyone. We are going to be playing the new Hitman game that just came out today. Hope everyone's excited. I'm excited. I'm a big fan of the Hitman series ever since I started playing, uh, maybe like four months ago. <laughs> anyway. I acknowledge, whatever. Probably saying I have to give my first born child, it don't matter. That actually, that's actually gonna work out just fine. Hmm, hmm, yes. Hmm. Okay, so, um, there's big spoilers for the previous game. You were, what do you know, manipulated from the beginning by this other person who was hiring you to do things you would have found disagreeable in the big picture. But now there's a, uh, an illustrious, um, let's see here, shadowy cabal you have to fight. And then there's a third malefactor who's trying to attack them both or something or other. Eh, it's pretty cool. Let's check it out. The shadow client, whoever he is. The story so far. Agent 47 and his handler, Diana Burnwood, are the world's top assassins working for the ICA. When all of their recent missions turn out to be contracts for a shadow client, things take an unexpected turn. All their targets have been operatives in an invisible organization known as Providence. Providence has infiltrated the highest echelons of power and LTG calls it owns our world. The Shadow Client wages a silent war against them. And so the Constant, Providence's enigmatic controller, seeks Diana out. His request, track down and eliminate the Shadow Client. No. In return, he offers something irresistible. The truth of 47's lost origins. I say no. Neither know that the man they hunt is 47's childhood friend. And unlike 47, he remembers everything. So yeah, this is a little bit more deep of a story than usual Hitman games. I mean, like I said, I'm not trying to talk shit on Hitman's story, it's just, it's always been kind of relatively simplistic. It doesn't really need to be ambitious, because it's more about the gameplay. Dude, this is super cool. My boat? Right. At the location. No hostile presence. Understood. Alma Reynard's house is just up the beach. Our intel indicates that she and her team are laying low. No Ooh, we got a new interface now. It's okay. likely planning the militia's next strike. Reynard is one of the Shadow Clan's top lieutenants. And yet she's not a target. Not yet, anyway. Yeah, how would we know she's that? She's no anyway? doubt high on our client's list. But for now, it's information we seek. Infiltrate the house and get us a lead on the shadow client. Okay. That's well, some B and E forty seven. On my way. Well, this is difficult. Usually, I just murder. Wait, what's this area discovered? It's a new thing. See, when you crouch, no one can see you. It's impossible. You admit, like a like a dampening field. It, it just, it just, it always works. Can't be detected. Whoa, whoa, what's this? What's this Metal Gear Solid four, uh, 5 ring around me? Oh. That must be like, if they come within that ring, they can see me. But if they're outside the ring, I'm invisible. Good aim. Now, according to the local home security provider, the house is equipped with multiple cameras placed around the perimeter. I suggest you get rid of them, 47. Sure can.
Doesn't seem like anyone's here. This isn't good. Man, look at look at the scenery. This is gorgeous. See, this game doesn't really necessarily need to sell you on like super deep Metal Gear Solid 2 level stories. It just sells you on awesome visuals and excellent gameplay. It's basically the, uh, okay, I hate being those people who bring Dark Souls and everything. Is, is this a Dark Souls of Scrabble? No, it's not. It's kind of, Dark Souls plays more on gameplay and visual details than it really does on story. Not that the games don't have story, it's just it doesn't primarily base it around that. The stories are usually more vague and... Yes, I've got my fizz. A security camera. Oh no, that's not what he says. He says a surveillance camera. Yes, Snake. Surveillance camera. Colonel. I don't get it, Colonel. Please don't move. Wow, my controls are really sensitive. Okay, we should have all the cameras down now. Now what's this? Ooh. See, that's gonna create a lot of noise. I don't know if I wanna do that. Doesn't look like anyone's in here. This is a trap. This is a damn trap. another... Okay, since no one's here, it doesn't really matter. Screwdrivers. This is good. I have a hard time finding these. I guess, I guess they want you to go into the garage. I really don't think that's a good idea. It's going to be too loud. Climb up that pipe? No, it's too narrow. Is this open? Nope. Well, those are just lights. Okay, well, let's go into the garage. I might as well just scream hysterically that I'm entering the house. So how does she see Looks these like things? like Raynard's grisly handiwork, all right. She was never shy about collateral damage. The owners? Don't think so. The house is registered to a non-existing environmental NGO. This feels more like identity theft. Like you, Raynard is known to use disguises. Uh-oh. Keep looking, 47. This is Nothing we can do for these people now. Masks. Rope. Chloroform. Looks like another kidnapping. I wouldn't put it past them. The Shadow Client is nothing, if not industrious. Why is he doing this? Clearly, he has an axe to grind with Providence. Big enough to surround himself with murderers and terrorists. Big enough not to care who gets hurt in the process. He believes he's doing the right thing, I suppose. Just like everyone else. I don't think I'm doing the right thing. In fact, I'm pretty sure I'm doing the wrong thing most of the time. Can I heard a voice. Ooh, we got breakfast cereal. What we got? We got Captain Sugar Rush. Man, that guy looks pretty excited. I want some Captain Sugar Rush. Let's grab this expired spaghetti sauce. You never know when you might need it. Oh, that's the voices I was hearing. Yeah, this is a trap. This is such a this is such a damn trap. Chloroform. Ooh, you can do... That's a new poisoning method. Well, sort of. It was intimated in previous games. Okay, what's this? What's 
this, 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 this. That might be useful. Let's open the front door. What's, what's this? What's this? Okay, so there's something, Sorry, wrong. The repair guy. something wrong with the ventilation upstairs. Okay, this might be useful. Ooh, boy. Okay, it's a little too quiet. Can't live too rough. Found something. Looks like research reports. Berlin, Shanghai. Every major malicious strikes as Thomas Cross is kidnapping. Looks like Reynard had a hand in all of them. All in the past, I'm afraid. Keep looking, 47. Yeah, I'm gonna need these. This is kind of a deviation for uh, 47 here. Usually he's used to killing someone. But just stealth infiltrating? Yeah, that's crazy. Wait, who, that's, is that a person? That's a trap. I'm gonna explore everything else first before I go in there. That's a trap. Hey, no way. This game teaches you to kind of be a kleptomaniac. I'm just walking around stealing everything I can find. Um, let's see. Ooh. That's a beautiful setting. No, no, no. I need the, I need the car battery. It's a much more sturdy weapon. Kill someone to death with this thing. What's this? Oh, poison, huh? Okay, I guess it's time to go spring trap. Well, luckily, I've got my car battery. I can peg someone right in the head with this thing and kill them, so. Should be alright. came in. What's, what's this? Oh, that's what that door came from downstairs. Man, I'm loving this. I'm sure whoever's going to ambush me is getting a little annoyed that I keep farting around and looking at other stuff. Like, we hear him in the house just running circles around. What the hell? Hmm. Forty-seven. That computer. See if you can't access it. Encrypted. Hmm. I have seen Assuming that I can't access this. Reynard wouldn't just leave it lying around. Wait. According to the floor plan, the room you're in should be a lot bigger. Oh yeah, I know. There might be a concealed space behind the wall. Check for hidden panels. Mm, let's go ahead and grab all this. Wait, what's this? Tranquilizer gun. Ooh, we're on some next gen tech here. You know, I'm gonna grab that sword. Let's grab here we this. go. 
For the office computer, no doubt. Destroy evidence. Nicely done, 47. Should allow you to move more freely. Okay, I'm gonna come back down here. What is this? Hmm. Appears Reynard's cell is launching another strike. Those are sewer maps of a residential area in Wellington. Well, there's nothing we can do about it now. Our priority is the Shadow Client. I'm in. Hurry. I'm detecting movement up the road. A motorcade, possibly Reynard's. Uploading the data. Hold on. Receiving it now. Hmm. Nothing on the Shadow Client or the other cells. No names, no aliases. So nothing. I doubt she even knows whom she's working for. Wait, here's something. A message from Robert Knox of Kronstadt Industries. I'm just he's carrying this car better. I mean, this is great. He's a Providence operative. A defector. Well, well, well. Client won't like this one bit. And you can't wait to tell him. They're back. Multiple hostiles. I see them. Damn. Okay, we've got all we're going to get. Go to stage 247. Eliminate Reynard, and preferably without raising suspicion. One step ahead of the Shadow Client for once. Let's keep it that way. Ugh, I thought this night would never end. What a snob fest. And I even missed out on the action. <sighs> I'm sorry you had to endure all that free champagne and cello music, Orson. What can I say? You really took one for the yeah, team. Yeah, well, I say stick to what you know. And I don't know anything. Alright, let's save, because this is going to turn into a shooting fest. Oh god, how are they already surrounding me? My objective. Death by car battery. Ooh, that was gruesome. the strongest tactical weapon with me. Kill her with a bicycle. Ooh, I figured out what I need to do. I need to get up to the roof and ventilate the crap out of this area. And look at all this crap I've got. Sounds like a champion. No, Max doesn't like being tied down. Well, they do say pets take after their owners. I like these guys. These are funny. Man, the conversations are still great on the. Whoa, rifle is that? This is. This makes me kind of sad because I have to murder these men. Mission. 
all too easy. Who rifle is this? Man, I've got one of ours on the ground. Hold on. Where is she? A shot of that really. Copy command. No one cares. Come on. This is going well. Come in, you copy. Yeah, I'm here now. No, nothing. Be quiet here. Over. Over. Okay. Ooh, let's now let's dump it in here. <laughs> All too easy. Trap, like, like someone who's trapped. <laughs> Command area is all clear. Please advise, over. Keep your eyes open, okay? I copy. Command, I'm up on the terrace, and the area is clear. Over. Sometimes things aren't as clear as you think they are. Alright. Let's see. I'm thinking that I should just wait for these two jokers to... need to kill you, but I'm going to. Because I don't want you to not be part of the action. Target down. Well done, 47. Now get off the property. Dump. Nope. Ooh. Man, there's so many guys on the screen at any time. here. Okay, I'm gonna wait for this joker to cross. Then I'm gonna try and dash across to this other clutch of grass over here. I can't kill him because he absolutely will get spotted by all these jerks standing around. Let me save real quick. This is gonna get violent. Like a chameleon, an American chameleon. The Mercs have discovered your boat, 47. They're on high alert, combing the beach for intruders. Oh, Proceed with caution. Hmm. No way to get past them unnoticed. I suggest you cause a distraction, 47. Okay. I will distract you with. One. 
Get a better idea. What's my what's my angle here? Well, I'll try out this new tranquilizer. Did that do anything? Holy shit! That thing's got a whole lot of bullet drop. Uh, uh. Let's see. Take this spaghetti sauce. Investigate that spaghetti sauce. That all went relatively well. Let's get out of here. Damn, just ice cold. Bet I could go back there and do a whole bunch of different optional missions now. See how that, that worked? I paid attention to some intel from that guy. Go on the phone there. Proximity explosive from the very beginning of the game? That's great. Okay, that's the place that they were talking about earlier. Wellington, right? has given us carte blanche. Hunt down the militia by any means necessary. A week ago, Providence was a threat. How did you swing the board? The board are practical people, 47. A blank check is hard to turn down. Besides, the Shadow Client's war on Providence is causing a global panic. Someone will need to stop the militia. Might as well be us. And the man on the train? Offer. Taking a contract for personal gain is against ICA regulations. Sodas would have been proud. Is that a sense of humor, 47? Whatever next? Crying at the movies? Maybe. Why are you doing this? I know what it's like to have everything taken from you. He claims to know about your past. Your childhood, your memories, everything Old Meyer stole from you. And you trust him? About as far as I can throw him. But this is our best lead in 20 years. I say it's time we break a few rules. And now what am I doing now? They're taking out a militia? I gotta kill all of them? Oof. That's gonna be rough. I mean, I suppose I could do it.
No. What do I need to do in advanced training? I've already completed all the advanced training. What are you talking about? Oh, is it going to take me back to the very prologue initial and in, in initial training of the very first game? Not the very first game. Okay, so this is this was what happened in the first game, first game, 2016. Here I am, uh, the James Bond villain from uh, Die Another Day. Welcome to the agent program, Nishant. I'll be waiting for you inside. Follow the lights, please. I don't really need to do this, do I? I've already done the training. This is stupid. But sure, this will serve as a prologue for everybody else, I suppose. Majestic, isn't it? I'm Diana. I'll take you to your quarters. Someone likes to keep secrets. Secrets are our stock and trade. Besides, from what I hear, you have a few of your own. No, I don't. I told you that. I'd like you, in case you're wondering. I'm in the handler program. Agents and handlers work in unity. You know the expression. Know your enemy? Well... That part is my job. Knowing your enemy is only half the victory. I know. The other half you is also violence. need to know yourself. I'm working on it. I read your case file. Impressive work. Partly textbook, but I suppose field work never is. Tell me, what did it feel like? Taking lives? Random. Disordered. Is that why you came here? Why you let us test you? Maybe I'm not the only one being tested. Well, we are here. Basic training starts at 0600 oh, God, I shouldn't have to do this. I know how I to do all this. Leave you to prepare. Are you sure about this? Mm -hmm. I am. There are no second chances, Miss Burnwood. Not here. I choose him. May I inquire why? A blank slate? Antisocial? Apathetic and unresponsive. Yep. No doubt the boy shows promise, That's but... the greatest. Perhaps I see possibility where others see limitation. Isn't that what a handler does, sir? We'll see. Anyone can kill Miss Burnwood. He still remembers nothing? If he does, he's not sharing. We will check up on his story. The hospital in Romania. In the meantime, keep him under close watch. So the timeline kind of jumps all over the place here. It seems to be simultaneously before um, the first game and after the first game. This prologue apparently takes before place before the very first game. Welcome to Advanced Mission oh, Training. Crap. This operation originally took place in Sydney. The target was Calvin Ritter, infamous cat burglar, also known as the Sparrow. Yeah, this is you the will exact need to infiltrate mission. the yacht, isolate and eliminate your target, and exfiltrate, all without arousing suspicion. No, I'm not doing this. And remember, I can do it on as stream. an ICA I'm agent, move on. you are the most dangerous person in any room. But blunt force will get you nowhere in this business, and a true assassin never calls attention to himself. Good luck, initiate. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing this. I mean, I'll do it. I'll do it off stream. Everyone doesn't need to see all that. It's basically I just I'm so super good at my test, and I'm I'm the most baller person ever. Yeah, there's Sean Bean. I'm gonna kill his ass. Let's take a look at the patch. No, I'm not gonna look at that. Never mind. Cool. Okay, let's do our first mission. Good afternoon. Our first real mission. Your anyway. destination is the annual Global Innovation Motor Race in Miami, Florida. After analyzing the data from Reynard's computer, the case is clear. The Providence defectors are Robert and Sierra Knox, head of robotics developer Kronstadt Industries. A visionary inventor and technological innovator. 
Robert Knox has spearheaded Kronstadt Industries to the bleeding edge of technological development. They're making Terminators? His brilliant daughter, Sierra, is not only a financial wizard, but also a fiercely competitive race car driver with a fiery temper to match. Kronstadt enjoys enormous popularity with global consumers. However, few are aware that the company is also one of the world's leading suppliers of next-gen military tech. Last year, despotic ruler Jin Po employed prototype Kronstadt drones against peaceful civilian protesters in the now infamous Tanyan Valley incident. And although it has yet to be proven, there is little doubt that the Noxes personally broke at the deal, making them complicit in a war crime. It is unclear why the Noxes would betray their masters, but likely the fear of being next on the Shadow Client's hit list has pressured them to cut a deal with the enemy. Undoubtedly, with Kronstadt Industries on their side, the militia will increase their attacks tenfold. And so our contract obligates us to retire Robert and Sierra Knox and contain the damage they may inflict on Providence. I will leave you to prepare. All right, I got it. I'm gonna take all these clowns out. God, this game's so much fun. So this was the area that they showed in all the trailers and everything. Um, Ooh, highly security. Okay, like in the Hokkaido mission. Okay, let's see if I can smuggle anything in here. Ooh, hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm sure I'll find plenty of stuff to distract people with. I'm gonna bring my pistol. Mm -hmm. Okay. What kind of challenges we got here? Oh my goodness, I want to do that. What? Okay, well let's let's just be open ended. Let's do it. Uh No, I don't want guidance. I want to just do it. Whoa, what's wrong with that dude's head? What happened? Must have been burned up pretty bad. Okay. Um. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, let's... I gotta, I gotta not be a... Um, Overwhelmed by all the cool scenes in this map because I, I, I watched the trailer or the little demo play like three or four times I'm sure things are different now Welcome to Miami 47 The innovation race is on its last day and it is down to the wire Thousands of eager fans are gathered for the final laps of this unexpectedly close race. Sierra Knox is expertly piloting her red Kronstadt car. Her father, Robert Knox, roams the nearby expo building where Kronstadt is showcasing its new prototype car. The Kronstadt RK Mark III has seen fierce competition from the Chinese Kowloon Heavy Industries' new racer. Moses Lee, CEO of Kowloon, has taken a dominant lead and looks invincible. The stakes are as high as they can get. What a perfect day for a murder. transition that was so cool that guy right there he's my hero I'm following that mascot hey, how's it going what? yeah 
Let's see what I got in the intel flyer. Whatever. Excuse me. Not allowed. What? What'd I do? Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. I'm just standing here. Check my watch. This was ridiculous. Is this how it goes? I just got killed? It's retarded. Jeez, people are being ridiculous. Sorry, I didn't see that I need to be frisked. Apologize, I don't need to be gunned down like an idiot. Sir, if you want to come through, I'm gonna have to pat you down. It's okay. Just relax. You'll be on your way in a sec. time remaining? Don't worry, folks. Anything can still happen. All right. Good job, sir. Thank you. You're welcome. Look at all these dynamic NPCs on the game, and all in the map at the same time. Let's see where my uh, my stuff's hidden. Holy hell! Look how big this place is. This is outrageous. Now, where's my agency pickup? I'm right next to it. Wait, no, not. Wait, where am I? Where am I? I'm over here. Okay, so my agency pickup's over there. Bayside Center Car Park. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Man, this place is huge! Hey, imagine if I had to go on one of these killing sprees here. Get out of my way. A disgruntled Kronstadt employee has acquired some dirt on Sierra Knox and intends on blackmailing her. Disguised as one of the racing mascots, he plans to meet Sierra by the old motel. Well, I always did feel that pink was your color, 47. Is this guy going to go or what? Please don't move. I've called for assistance, but for now I need to stay still. 
some keys over there. Hey. Oh man, you're a real lifesaver. Thank you. Go to the bathroom or something so I can knock your ass out. Don't mind if I escort you there, do you? Now who's wearing the flamingo suit? Wait a minute, could I drag his body over there? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I wanna be very careful about all this. Objective it. Okay, which car is it? This one, this van right here. waving that about. Okay, I thought he said it was a van, so let's check each car, I suppose. Oh, it's over there. Okay, it was the van that I thought it was initially. Entering its final lap, forty seven. Did she win? Oh, shit, that guy knows who I am. He can see through my disguise. Uh, where is it? Let's see where the meeting area is supposed to be. Uh, that's not looking good. Yes, I know there's a camera recording me. So I find where the camera place is, it's just gonna have to record me and lower my score. It's just gonna have to happen. Excuse me, ex excuse me. Get out of the way. Mascot coming through. I basically run the place. Get out of my way. I get over this wall. Hmm. This ain't gonna work. Oh, okay. This is easy. Oh my gosh, stop. It's, it's kind of this weird, like, delay to the back button or the pause menu. It's like, I keep accidentally pressing it. That's right, basically I run this place, I told you. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Pardon me. Mascot coming through. Sir, this is off limits. Aw, come on. The mascot. Alright, alright. Alright, I'm 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 leaving. I'm leaving. 
There ain't no need for all this. Holy shit. You're not allowed anywhere. You know, I thought this place was pretty nice. God, I was always so uptight about Hello stuff. There. Get out of my way. I'm mad. I'm gonna take my aggression out on you. Well, let's just say she's got a bad case of intermittent explosive disorder. What? Dr. Sorensen. First, he almost loses a patient to a seemingly harmless and case of dehydration. Of and now he has to deal with this race. guy suffering and from anything. urinary retention. Depression. I know it's just a simple injection, but given his track record these past few days. Well, at least we know who's buying his beer tonight. So, it seems hmm. Sierra Knox has jumped on the revitalization bandwagon and is scheduled for an injection of some sort. The doctor who is supposed to help her with the procedure is preoccupied with a patient who is unable to urinate. Curious situation, 47. Maybe you can speed things up. Okay, well, it doesn't really matter. I don't actually want to do that. I want to go back to the pink mission. I'm the mascot. I assume you know me. <laughs> nice outfit. Really brings out your eyes. Yeah, I appreciate that. Miss Knox informed me you'd be here. She asked to make sure you brought the documents. So, did you bring the documents? I have the papers right here. Excellent. Come on in. Have a seat or something. I'll let Miss Knox know you're here. So far, so good, 47. Now, let's yes. see where this meeting is headed. There's a guy here wearing a mascot outfit claiming you have an appointment with him. What do you say? Got it. I'll let him know you're on route. Hey, Flamingo guy. Miss Knox is on her way. Good. Have a seat somewhere. She'll be here as soon as she can. As the flamingo, you know my time is very valuable. Uh oh. I've gotten word that my my uh, stream has broken. Adoring fan. <laughs> All right. Yeah, wait, what was I supposed to do? Oh, here she comes. Who can't be who can't take me seriously right now? I've got incriminating evidence and I'm a flamingo. So, mister. Hmm. I never did catch your name. Names are for friends. Very well. Straight to the point, we're all business. Walk with me. Where are no. we going? Don't worry. What am I gonna do? Hey, bud, man. Kill you in broad daylight. No, that's what I'm gonna do. Not about to do sensitive business like this in front of an audience. Good idea. Get out. Don't hassle me, sir. You don't want this flamingo ass whooping. So just to get this straight, you claimed in your email to have somehow found internal reports that show Kronstadt's involvement in the Tungan Valley Massacre. That's so correct, I did. Right. Let's be clear. You and I are having this meeting because my father doesn't need to know about this. It's just another undesirable How are you doing that? I don't care if the information is true or false. I don't care if it mentions moving money from the Nexus How project into Tungan Valley Damage like Control. I mean, as look at that costume. Your correspondence. I do care about protecting my father, which is why you and I are now here. I see. Leave me alone for a few minutes, guys. Sure thing, Miss Knox. Fuck off. I am the person you're doing business with. You are not going to talk that way. Documents and leave, and that's the end of it. And you will do that now. Hmm. Let me think about that. Okay. Here you go. 
So here are the two possible outcomes of this meeting. One, you will leave this place and this country for good, and that will be the end of it. Everyone lives happily ever after. Two. No! No! Target down. Next up, Robert Knox. I'm sure everyone sees that I am a force to be reckoned with. I got a cool shovel out of the deal too, because I just said I liked it. Hmm. Yeah, that's white blood, man. Nobody messes with my staff. <laughs> I just messed the crap out of her. I just killed the hell out of her. Ooh, what do we got? Mm -mm. Uh, one moment. Going great. Uh, Minoli. This is my ride, I can tell. Give me the car. Okay. I'll get to the bottom of this. Oh yeah? Get to the bottom of this. Uh oh. Okay, so there's the other guy. He's over there. Man, that went really well. My flamingo outfit just basically fooled everyone. And no one cares that I'm wielding a shovel, so... Alright. see if we can't work our way over towards that guy. Man, this map is huge. I really can't stress that enough. This is... I mean, look at all these NPCs on the screen at one time. That's really compelling. See, see, watch. Watch this. Right, everyone take take a minute here. Appreciate this. Now, I'm not trying to be violent here. I just want to see everyone's... Look at that. That's incredible how we got all those characters to... And the frame rate's not dropping or anything? People are, people are animated? That's great. That's pretty good. Okay. Sorry, I didn't really mean to cause a killing spree. I know that's America's new favorite pastime, but I just mostly wanted to see the different panic animations and what have you of the characters. Like that's that's something that should be commended. Murdering flamingos with gunfire should not be commended though. What I did was basically innocent and childish and should be forgiven. Excuse me, get him away. Pardon me. Where'd he go? Where is he? Wow, he's all. Wait, wait, where is he? Whoa. Okay, so. Hmm. Hmm, there's only a couple bridges across. Is there an underground area? There is. Okay. It's, yeah, there's a slight delay when you pause and unpause. So I keep thinking I didn't unpause. Then I repause like an idiot. Crap. What a mess. You really? Something like that. Really a mess, sir. Some sort of power mech? What is that? What is that sound? Yeah, I don't have a key card. It's gonna take forever to find all the cool stuff on this mission. So I figure what I'm going to do is kind of just do like, um, maybe like one or two, two or three missions. Hey, 
like that. And then I'm going to start replaying them, and then after I've got quite a good amount of progress and got some cool weapons and stuff unlocked, then I'm going to move on to the other missions. It's kind of what I was doing before. Standing in line behind him yesterday, he talked about how he loves this place to death. To death, eh? It seems Robert Knox paid several visits to a Bayside area food stand yesterday. The vendor, known as Florida Man, sells extremely addictive food, so we should expect Knox to return. Maybe this is a way to catch Knox away from his office. That sounds good. Let's get it. Let's kill him through his stomach. It's a good way to die. Uh-oh. Gone fishing. Okay, where is this lad? Hmm. Hmm. Locate Florida, man. That's any news headline from Florida. Locate this guy. We don't know where he is. Crap, I can't get over this. Uh, it, it just needs to be praised all day. Look at this shit. Look how beautiful everything is here. Everything's so detailed. You got this massive map of all these characters. Hey, how's it going? Well, I can't push him because I need his pants. Yo, Em, it's me. Look, I need the Holy crap, this guy's got a lot of flies flying around. Crystal, right? Well, I can't very well cook without it, can I now? You're putting meth in the food? Dressed as what? Speak up, woman. Dressed as a flamingo. I didn't do anything. Forgot his keys, and now I'm gonna get killed. Come on, don't do this. Look, you you were 300 months from his retirement. Okay, we're gonna have to reload because these guys are just gonna cause too much trouble. <sighs> That's annoying and stupid. Oh. How? Um, I'm only about in the. Uh, well, I had an introductory prologue mission. And um, and then I am in my first, like, story mode mission. And I've only killed the first person of my two targets. Well Shut that. up. There. Okay, pick up the keys. Okay, uh, but uh, yeah, this is my first story mission. Um, there's a bunch of, uh, um, what were they, um, how do I get in here? There was a bunch of, uh, oh, um, tutorial missions that I didn't do because they were the same tutorial missions from the last game, and I'm not going to do all those. Hmm. How does a drifter like that pay for a ticket? Hey, I do my best, sir. Okay, so what's my, what's, how am I going to get in here? The only way I can see getting in is I'm going to need to go find a crowbar. Like, if it's any of my other stuff, it's going to take forever. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, time to flee the scene. 
Find a crowbar. Oh, there it is. Oh, it came up. Hammer too, or it's not a ball, whatever. Oh shit! Um, wait, where's the crowbar at? Did I miss it? Must have missed it. Where's it at? Okay, it's up at the top, I bet. to knock this fool out. No, I don't. Okay. Is this really just like a flap of a door? Oh. They found that body. I'm sure they're flipping out right about now. Can't do it while those guys are standing there. I need them to go find some, something else to do. Like, seriously, not spot that dead body right there? What a nerd. Oh, hold on a minute. I'm sorry, did I interrupt something? Yeah, Will. I'm basically unstoppable. Oh, thank God I found you. I need some help here. Oh my God. Really? He's a fraud. Okay, I'll check it out. You're just mad because I ruined your damn shot. This could have been avoided. Every last part of this. No, this is kind of lame. I want. I want to do that stealthily. I get in every shootout all the damn time. That guy's just mad because I interrupted a stupid shot from his camera. I might murder him later. Yeah, I'll, I'll try my best not to draw attention to myself. Oh, now he discovered it. Here we go, here we go. Are you okay? Oh shoot! Holy crap, he came back to life! What the fuck? Let go of me. Uh I was oh, um Okay. Ooh, good, they're gone. Alright, excellent, excellent, excellent. can leave me alone as I get this door open. One moment.
Okay, so now I'm gonna go just put that rat poison there. Let's see, is that guy around? I'm gonna dispose of these bodies if he's not around. Uh, I, I thought I killed this guy. It turns out I was just not, I knocked him out. Enjoy your swim, buddy. Get this gun, get this boat rental key. Oops, I just dropped the gun over the side, whatever. Later, loser. Oh, well, well, let's see the food. Well, let's see my competition. Let's see, we got quarter pounder, half pounder, cheeseburger, bacon double cheese. Ooh, that sounds good. What do you got, man? Hot dog, chili dog, hot dog with onions, hot dog with cheese and fries. That chili dog's expensive though. Ten dollars? I don't know. Master of disguise. Hi there. Hi, right, how's it going? What do you want? Good show, 47. Now stick around. Once the word spreads, Knox won't be long. Let's get a new file going. <laughs> he smelled the flies. And the, the coconut balls here. And he's coming for some. I'm not giving you guys any. Go away. These are the poison is limited supply. Get lost. I'm waiting for this man right here. Forty-seven. Robert Knox is on the move. Yeah. If I'm not mistaken, he's heading down to the Bayside food stand selling coconut balls. Those does sound good. I could go for some coconut balls right now. Come on, get them while they're stinky and oily. So wait, are my are these flies like drawn to my clothing? That must be it, ma'am. I. I love you and I appreciate you and you can have all you want after I'm done killing this guy. Oh. Yeah, I normally I go in shootouts all the time, and that's fun and all, but I think for like the first one I'm going to try my best to be legit. Okay, see now here's a huge ethical thing here. Um, I'm going to get in trouble for not serving people. The thing is, is I'm more than happy to serve people. I just need to serve this guy first, not because of any other reason than because I want to kill his ass. Y'all can have what's left, that ain't a problem. In fact, they're on the house, you can have the rest for free. Hey, how's it going? Smell alone is enough to trigger a massive rush of dopamine. <laughs> I like this man He's already. He's putting in his food, but I've sure got the munchies. Here. Care to try something special? So, what's good? Everything's to die for, Mr. Knox. Excellent. Maybe one of these. Yes, eat that. That. Eat. Make sure you eat it all. Sometimes the poison's kind of centered in one area. That was superb, my good man. Back for more. <sighs> I'm sorry, it goes right to the anus. I, I mean, it just does. Oh, okay. You need to see a doctor. Now. He needs to go potty. I will escort him to the throne room. 
Well, he's just gonna go over the side. That's okay. Both targets down. Well done, forty-seven. I'm out of here. And that went well. Okay. Excuse me. Get out of my way. Exit options. There's a bunch of exit options here. Uh, this one here. Oh, that's a helicopter. I bet. Eh. Yeah. How do I get out here? I don't think I can cross the road, it's just a freaking race car is going by. I'm an employee uniform, I should be able to get past. See, there was a method of my madness in wearing this flamingo suit again. Now I can just walk right past people. Talking shit? Bet you won't do that again. Your friend died. He should keep his mouth shut about flamingos. I mean, look how big this map is to explore. It's gonna be pretty daunting. Excuse me, gentlemen. How are you, sir? Shut up. <laughs> I want to wear this all the way to the other end of the se sewers. That's going to be great. I'm doing my best, thank you. <laughs> His maps are big and scary and confusing. Okay, inventor. Yeah, just call me Ryoga Hibiki. Damn, that's good, right? I think. What did I unlock? The... Oh, is it a total mastery? Oh, that's not like... Okay, so there's location mastery and total rank, okay. Good. So what do I unlock? Okay, that's pretty good. Oh, that slot's available. Briefcase, a fish. Okay, there's my probably the weapon I'm going to be using for the most of the game. Dolphin fountain starting point. Marina. Yeah, that's my plan. As I plan to go and do those ones. Um, okay, but I'm gonna I'm gonna come back to it. I'm gonna go play the other one. Next mission. Berlin. Shanghai. Montreal. We're bleeding operatives. Panic is spreading, and now we're <laughs> Wait a minute, is that the, uh, the floating pyramid spaceship from Kung Pao? He would have caused incalculable damage. And he won't be the last. This is exactly what the enemy wants. We need to fight the sickness, not the symptom. <laughs> and I have just the tool for the job. Right. The Burnwood woman. Eric Soders warned you Bravo. about her, didn't he? The Crusader. I can handle this Burnwood. Everyone hates power until you offer them some. I would like some power, please. 
ICA speaks the enemy's language. We need them. And once we don't, <laughs> we'll cross that bridge when we get there. With the exactly. giant apparatus we like this? Boxing. We need to know who we are up against. I was getting to that. His name is Lucas Gray. The late Mr. Cobb's head of security. Mr. Cobb, who's that? Cobb again? was ground zero. First of our operatives to die. Oh. It had to be one of his staff, someone with military training and access to the plane. <laughs> what a boss. Yeah, grasping at straws. Gray is a mercenary, a veteran of every backwater tragedy you've ever ignored on the five o'clock news. That's a good way of saying that. That's pretty good. Leone. The list goes on, but before 89, nothing. No records of any kind. Ah, oh, come on. CIA, KGB, plenty of spies went dark. After the curtain was lifted, I cast a very wide net. Lucas Gray simply does not exist. <clears throat> if you're all quite done wetting yourselves with excitement, your favorite I don't character. Give shits where he came from. I only want to know one thing. How does he know about us? I swear to God, this hearts and flowers crap will get us both killed. Can't you see? Your so-called friend is working for them now. He's not the man you knew. This is his fight too, Olivia. Even if he doesn't realize it. I guess they're talking about me. Like it or not, no. 47 is our last and only lead on the partners. He needs to remember. He's coming for us. And unlike you, he won't hesitate. Just get me inside. <laughs> I'll just get lost trying to Rico, find my way there. I need a favor. I thought that's was Central Europe. Oh, I guess it could be still. Okay, where am I? Okay, three-headed serpent. Let's do it. What brilliant new setting are we going to now? South Africa morning, or South America? I mean? Our Providence contact has shared the identity of the Shadow Client, a former mercenary and bodyguard by the name of Lucas Gray. His past is a black void, but our analysts are digging deep. <laughs> so he's some sort of ancient one? We've had a breakthrough of our own. Comparing the malicious attack patterns with global shipping and transportation routes, we've figured out how Mr. Gray and his paramilitaries move around the world undetected. They're using the distribution network of the Delgado Cartel. Hey, Columbia's that's pretty good. Biggest drug manufacturer. Clearly, Gray must have struck a deal with the Delgados. Consequently, if we can cripple the cartel, we can severely limit the militia strike. I don't range. remember who this militia to is. So, we need to slay a three-headed serpent. Sociopathic cartel head Rico Delgado and his two closest lieutenants, PR guru Andrea Martinez and savant chemist Jorge Franco. With equal parts guts and guile, Rico Delgado runs a thriving billion-dollar criminal empire. The word is, the brutal and volatile cartel head is hell-bent on becoming the number one drug lord in the world. It's good to have dreams. To achieve this, Martinez, a childhood friend of Delgado's, has been buttering up state leaders and decision-makers, paving the way for an expansion of the Delgado logistics network while the brilliant but aloof and antisocial Franco has been hard at work developing a new type of super cocaine. Super cocaine. So, three of Columbia's it's like the one punch man of cocaine. Inhabiting a decidedly hostile environment. I will leave you to prepare. All right. Let's see. Uh, no, I'm, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna look at any of that. Casual tourist. Let's see what my smuggled item could be. Oh, I don't have any places. <laughs> you 
Okay, I'm gonna go in my suit in the middle of this jungle. It's great. Let's do it up. I think this is the first time, or no, the second time ever that the Hitman has gone to South Africa. I keep saying South Africa. South America. Uh, we also took out a bunch of drug dudes in Colombia in another game. Um, I think so. I think they're drug dudes. But anyway, it was definitely around that region. I'm sure there's other things happening in South America besides that. Don't we have some, like, dangerous Peruvians we could take down? Welcome to Colombia, 47. The remote village of Santa Fortuna awaits you deep inside the Colombian rainforest. An iron-fisted Delgado cartel rules over the village and its surroundings. Security around Santa Fortuna and the closed-off cartel compound is extremely tight. Armed sicarios patrol the streets of the village, ready to enforce harsh punishments to those who do not comply. Rumors persist of hidden transportation cave systems connecting the village, the cartel compound, and the hidden coca fields beyond. It is a rare occurrence to have all three cartel leaders present in the village at the same time. Expect that all targets are protected by scrupulous killers armed with automatic weapons. Rico Delgado inhabits his fortified mansion on the outskirts of the village, while Andrea Martinez can be found in her village office, or around Santa Fortuna itself. And Jorge Franco is engaged in development of a new drug in his field laboratory. Happy hunting, 47. Oh, goodness. Man, I am sticking out. I am I'm a very, very uh, obvious gringo here. Let's, let's get a scale of the map here. Jesus. <laughs> Wow, you got all these dr you got all these jungles, you got this compound here. This is this is immense. And there's all the tunnels that she was talking about. Is this Jorge or Rico Delgado? And this is what's her name? Where's the other guy at? He's in the laboratory. Oh my goodness, wow. Wait, he's right across the street. I'm just gonna go over there and murder him. Oh. Doesn't work that way. Something I've kind of noticed about these areas, um, whenever they show them in movies or shows and whatnot, they always look kind of run down the houses, which I mean, that's to be expected. But they always have like a satellite dish on the side. There you go, see? How does that happen? You see the poster? Rico Delgado coming down to us dirty villagers to unveil some ridiculous statue. Sure, I was at the bar last night and the band were really good, both with the music and the drinking. But my husband told me nobody seen them since. So that's why Martinez and the Delgado sicarios are running around like hellish chickens. Must grind her gears to finally know how things go her way. I'm sure they're fine. Probably just passed out somewhere, you know? Martinez will find them. She always gets in her way. Hmm. Holy crap, look how far that guy is. So, the ever-classy Rico Delgado has commissioned a statue of himself to adorn the village square. Today's unveiling ceremony will feature a local band, and Rico Delgado will attend in person. I suggest you take a closer look, 47. This should be a unique opportunity to engage Delgado outside the walls of his compound. Okay, that sounds good. Let's, let's find out. Sabotage Delgado's statue. How do I sabotage it? Oh, I guess I could just like. Oh, okay, I get it. I was I was kind of stupid there for. Oh, I, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. 
I'm going. May no need to search. You know where I am. For some reason I thought it was like like a truck. I sabotaged his truck. It's like, no, those don't really work. Okay. Um. Oh, that's easy. Okay. Let's just go up here. And I'm immediately lost. Is it trespassing up in here? I think it is. Who's this guy? I'm a mason, let me in. Hippo holding pen? Where's that at on the map? Let me see. Let me see. Where, where, where would I put a hippo holding pen? You know, actually, that makes sense. Those drug cartel people have, like, zoos and crap. It's probably around here. It's where I'd put my hippos. Or right here. New intel. Amigo, too many beers last night. Okay, what are my options here? Ooh. Someone's got a bag on their head. I'm completely incognito. Hippo holding pin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Et cetera, et cetera. Doesn't make it look like an accident. I don't, I don't have a wrench. Where's the wrench at? If I were a wrench, where would I be? Near some sort of maintenance area. This whole village looks like a maintenance area. Is there a wrench around here? There should be a wrench place right here. At least I got a good disguise now. I can pretty much go anywhere I need to. guide to look up where the wrench is either, so I have to pretty much completely at the mercy of finding one. Okay. That's a newspaper. That is P-Power. Real name, Paul Powers. Celebrity tattoo artist and reality TV star. See, I don't think a wrench would be around here somewhere. Oh boy, it's gonna be another one of these where I'm searching for an hour and a half to find something. Great. Uh, ooh, 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 ooh! That's a crowbar, I can open doors with it. That's something. That's good, that's good. Look, I will give you all, like, a million dollars in pesos. I think he's on the mend now. He got lucky, I guess. So what happened? He says it's better if I don't know. The Delgado cartel is very sensitive around it. Some sort of secret project. So, an employee of the Delgado cartel was injured while working on a secret... 
problem is he's essential to the project, and now we have Sicarios hanging around our house. Okay, well that could also just give me a good disguise, so let's go ahead and go for that. I'll give you all a bunch of pesos. Or what? what is the currency in Colombia? I honestly don't remember. Is it also pesos? Is it a form of peso? Hey, I'll give you guys a bunch of them if you just let me have a wrench. Any wrench will do. Uh, I'm going to be all over this fishing village looking. Ooh, ooh. That's a coin. It can help with distracting someone. I am a Sucario. I'm going to follow you. Wait, wait, what's up here? Is there a maintenance area up here? Nah. I'm ringing the doorbell. Leave me alone. Oh my god, I'm climbing through this window. Seems like your husband just died. Wait, where's his pants? Crap. She won't recognize her own husband. Flee the scene! See what I'm talking about? I always get myself into these damn messes. Stop shooting me. Where's a wrench? <laughs> the damn wrench. Ooh, you know what? There might be, in the sub base, there might be a... Uh, yeah, 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 that could work. There could be a wrench down there. There better be, or I'm really screwed. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's where I... I think we're all upset about. Everyone needs to relax. Yeah, okay, we're all going towards it. Get him away. Get him away. Important drug business coming through. Holy shit, people are mad. Ah, god damn it. I'm an idiot. <laughs> uh, I swear I'm good at video games. <laughs> Let's try this a little bit more stealthy. I think I might uh, pause my uh, in the stream after this mission, just because I'm gonna take a break and uh, uh, do something else, and I'm coming back to it maybe. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how I feel. Okay, for real. Where's a wrench? Ooh, this is like wrench central. Why would? Why don't you have a wrench? It's probably why you're all down there depressed because you ain't getting no business because you don't have a wrench. I'm not gonna bother with that tunnel thing right now. I'm gonna look for the wrench. There's just so much area to search. Is that a wrench? That's a cleaver. That ain't nothing. Wait, what's that? Is that a wrench? Well, oh, let's go check it out. It's a meaty bone. Okay, well that's going to be a weapon I use later on. Someone's going to get clubbed to death with a section of thigh. Okay, like I said, if I were a wrench, where would I be? Ooh! Mechanic shop. Oh no, it's a, f it's a fruit shop.
Yeah, it's like PUBG. I've got the frying pan. <laughs> There's gotta be like a bike shop or something. So like a machining shop somewhere around here. No, nothing. Man, people are about to get blanked like crazy with this frying pan if I don't find what I'm looking for. Uh, ooh, this looks like a shop. A lead pipe. Yo, you guys got a wrench? Hey, thanks, guys. Yeah, I'll bring it back. Ain't a problem. Alright, now, if I remember correctly, I got through here. Hey, 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 hey. Or grave robber, what are you going to do about it? I'm back, I found a frying pan. Save just in case someone sees me do it and loses their damn mind. Perfect. Okay, four missing bit. Are you kidding me? What's with this fetch quest crap? Uh, I can only assume they're around the village. I'll look around for people around the village. Probably should have tried to find the band members first. This is, this is going to be a lot of stuff. You! I'm hiring you for a band. Now. <laughs> oh, here's where <laughs> Rich would have been. <laughs> Easily. Keep us safe, soldado. Auto repair. Oops. What's this? Is there a compressor? It's a radio. Look at it! It's a funny looking vehicle, right? The tourists will be like, I get in the back of the looking good. I only have a lot of fun myself. I even install a horn that goes, nyang, nyang. See, it's brilliant. Like the time you offered to read the skiing lessons, we forgot to mention the piranhas. Ooh, harsh burn, yo. It's hard to come back from that. Yeah, hey, I need musicians in here. Shut up. That's how you can help me. I'm trying to find musicians. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be so rude, sir. You're just trying your best. I'm just really frustrated. Your grants are here. The fish. Damn it. I steal your wrench and you light me. Entonces, oh, that's my buddy's online. Javier is seeing his boss's daughter. You! You're a musician. He told me not to tell Excuse anybody. Me. So you know, don't uh, tell nobody. Oh my god. You're uh, kidding me, right? What? What? Oh, I hate that stupid garden. You love the garden more than you love me. Mm. I would have more respect for you if you had a mistress. Why are you doing this? So, P Power, celebrity tattooist of Tattoo Torment fame, has come to Santa Fortuna. Presumably to work his magic on Rico Delgado, a known ink enthusiast. That won't be necessary because I'll be killing him with the statue. I gotta find some more musicians. I'm putting together the old band, guys. What are you looking at? Can I holster my frying pan? I salute you. Thank you. I refuse to do the same because I'm holding a frying pan. I've got eggs somewhere around here. By the way, I love your old Buñuelos recipe. These guys, someone here is a musician. You. You look like you can jam. You. Who who here plays instruments? 
I bet you all could do some good vocals when I start blasting. Ooh, what do we got? Mate, I'm telling you, I've been in some crazy shit. Uh, this is an annoying fetch quest if ever there was one. This crowbar, just in case I need it later. My husband nearly lost his arm when that. Huh? Strange. Yes, oh. You, you're a musician, aren't you? Just laying here. Oh my goodness, this is annoying. Where are the musicians? You, you played no. I bet they're in the other areas of town. What are the areas of town? Wow, this is a big ass town. No, because that's the mansion grounds. That's a drug lab or something. Yes, yeah, so they have to be here in town somewhere. Oh, they just came up on my indicator. All right. If I wander around aimlessly enough, eventually they'll show up. Ooh, ooh, that guy I was talking to before. That's the guy. See, they make this game foolproof for idiots like me. Hey, man. Get up. I will beat you to death. Fine, I'll go get your friends first. I mean. Get up, you bum. As if I didn't have better things to do with my life. Okay, so I'm gonna have to play with the drummer then, huh? All right. It's like an all-stars gallery. I'm meeting all my old people again. Hey man, I'm, I'm, I, I know. I'm just trying to find my team. Oh, here he is. Wake up. Look at all these drunks. Ooh, here we go. You realize all these people would have been killed if I hadn't done anything. Because they, you know, he would have found where they all are and had him killed for not playing at the game. I've seen worse. You shut your head? You crazy guy. Oh, well, time to go on stage, I guess. And you got white? Hmm. You're crazy. You're getting crazier every second. So I'm told. Hey, did you see Pablo? Last I saw an idiot was trying to steal a dog to buy in a bar somewhere. He cut life for shit, though. I uh, hope he's okay. He's fine. I'll go get him right now. You'll feel better with a frying pan across the head. Pardon me. Official what? band business. Get up, stupid. Ay, Dios mío. Uh-huh. Ay, my head. Uh-huh. <sighs> Mm. 
my ultimate disguise, Bongo Cat. Sure, take your time, man. The music is moving people. We are rocking so good here. Almost got enough people to crowd surf. Wait, is she gonna be the one dedicating a statue? Oh, this is bad. She's gonna die. People of San Fortuna, the saints are truly smiling upon you all. Saints of Drugs. Day of celebration and joy. Today, yep. the Delgados present to you a gift unlike anything you have ever seen. Remember, we are... I think, I think what's going to happen is they're going to pull on that curtain, to take it off, and that's going to pull it over. I think that's what's going to happen. We upon you day and night. We will protect you from the corruption of the big city and the... Yeah, possibly. But I mean, this jam is pretty rocking. I think I might uh, put this on MP3 and uh, blare it out of my car stereo. Done 47. Poetic justice coming up. For our very own children. And so, it is my immense pleasure to present to you the benefactor of San Fortuna, the lion of Bogota. Come on! The man who has taken it upon himself to destroy corruption. Get up there and die. In this proud nation of ours. A man whose only concern is for the welfare and safety of this glorious village and all of proud Colombia. I give to you Rico Delgado! Yay! Pull the curtain. My dear, wonderful, grateful people. <sighs> it brings warmth to my heart. To see I'm about to pull a gun and shoot him. For years, decades, we have struggled against the oppressive forces of the outside world. The sun's setting? Why did it get so dark? The Delgado Cartel has been a bulwark against those who seek to do harm to you all. Well, today, we celebrate this struggle. And the victory See that uh, big red curtain on top of the statue there? Today, I grant you this symbol of freedom and rebellion. See, it's, it's attached to that string of flags there. I think he's going to pull that and it's going to pull it over. Hope of greatness and serve as something to aspire to. All of you can become as me one day. Drum roll, please. Uh, sure thing. <laughs> Rico Delgado <laughs> has been eliminated. <laughs> Nicely done. Love it when a plan comes together. This area seems clear. We're moving on. Bye, everybody.
Actually, I'm going to go back to the scene of the crime and kind of see how that's going to be handled. Anyone copy? Uh, still looking. No sign of trouble yet. Man, that dude died like a chump. All right. What's our next objective? Okay. All right, so we need, to, we need to look around for these other ones. I got a feeling one of them's in the jungle. I should go check out the jungle area. Oh, let's get a good save in here. Oh, that's good, that's good. Hmm. Hmm. She's got high standards. Oh, crap. I forgot my outfits in the that room. Oh, well. If I need to, I'll go back and get it. I think I'm good with this. I mean, it's not like an outfit that's going to get me immediately shot to death. I'll at least get told to leave. So this is a jungle? Alright, so that's the jungle area up here. Damn, this map is massive. I love it. These guys, they got something to say. Martin is most of the population of Martin's version. Why doesn't she just get it herself? She's got a lot on her mind. The construction of the new plant has been stalled for days now because of what they found there. She needs him to cleanse the place. <laughs> oh, it's an eldritch demons, huh? Yeah? So. Andrea Martinez wants the local shaman to do a spirit cleanse at the construction site. Okay, so where is the shaman? Okay, he's in the jungle, okay. Search of a spiritual release. Sure. Come on in, my friend. I feel free to join us. Everyone is unequal. Oh. The spirits. That's not possibly true. Oh. So they're literally blind? I, I could do all kinds of things in front of them and, and they wouldn't see anything? Their vision has turned inwards. Yes. Are you ready to try it out yourself? Mm, I'm getting all kinds of ideas here. You don't happen to have a magic marker, do you? They don't call me the prank master for nothing. You're an idiot. I'm getting up. Yeah, I'm very tempted to just start wasting all these stoners right here. Ooh, can I get that frog? How do you use the frog as the weapon? That'd be cool. Poisonous plant that could be useful. Shut up. Perhaps I'll look for my herbs too. Oh boy. I'll give this a couple more seconds, then I'm just gonna go kill everyone. Perfect. Hey, hey, what's wrong with you? You can't just knock people out. Whoa. What, like this? <laughs> These guys are blitzed so hard they didn't even see it. Great. That's phenomenal. I am the shaman now. Wait, where am I going? 
<laughs> yeah, I mean, that sounds like a good idea, but I don't do good ideas. I do stupid things. Besides, everyone's fine. Those druggies are having a good time. Everyone's having a great time. Yeah, I probably should have poisoned it, but eh. Oh, well. What's this? What do we got? Soda can. Soda can. Anything else? It seems like it'd be something more to this. Ooh. Yeah. I don't really need to do that. I need to go take care of this mission. I'll investigate some other time. Hey, what's up, guys? I just thought of something. I might need to drop my guns and stuff because they might pat me down. So let's see if I can find like a trash can or something to store them in. I don't want to just leave them out in the open. Someone loses their mind over it. Let's save first. They might not pat me down. Might be like, this guy's way too holy. Good to see you here. Uh huh. Cool deal. Welcome, Taita. Hey, Martinez is waiting for you in her office upstairs. Rad. Who the hell decides to keep all the windows open? Well, well. The famous shaman decides to show up after all. Yep, that's me. I'm pleased to finally put a face to the myth. I was beginning to think you didn't exist. What with your not replying to any of my inquiries? I've been looking forward to meeting you, Miss Martinez. All right. I need you to get over to the construction site on the outskirts of the village. The workers there uncovered a pile of old bones, and they've taken the opportunity to grab some undeserved recreational time. Yeah. I need you Religions to are such dumb, right? So dumb. Wave your magic wand or do an interpretive dance or whatever it is you do. I can do that. You can walk with me if you don't know the way. Otherwise, I'll see you there. Just don't take too long. I'm an important person and have many things to do. I will not wait around. Very well. I haven't been the way. Excuse me. There's spears to be destroyed. Maybe we go talk to that tattoo master and get me a shaman tattoo. seem to think they're part of some old grave. Sounds likely. Yeah. So now, they're on strike. Won't work until the site is cleansed. This is where you come in, you know? You can, you can help us out. I will destroy the bones. Excelente. Thank you so much. Muchísimas gracias. Okay. Have fun, sir. Have fun? Oh wow, that is pretty gruesome. That does look like it'd be super haunted. Hmm. 
Looking good, man. Looking good. Cleanse away. Everyone sit back and watch me rock. There you go. Everything's done. The site is clean now. See, I work fast. I just did a few gestures. What are you guys talking about? I basically just did JoJo poses. Bless the worthwhile endeavor we are pursuing here. They're at peace now. Expertly moved onto the afterlife by your Taita. Yep, in the afterlife. I am confident this is the end of it. I get back to work. Nicely done. Looks like the foreman is going to tour the site and show some of the machinery to Andrea Martinez. This might be your chance, 47. Kinda. Okay, there's a lot of potential accidents I could put her in. If she was still standing here, I could hit that switch. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah. I give in to peer pressure all the time. Okay, so wait, would that shoot out with such high power that it would kill her? Let's try it. You know what? Ooh, that's mean and bad. Ah, 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 that's great. She stole my pan, though. I'm not cleansing that one for free. This next one's going to cost you. Alright, what am I... Did I... Okay, so... Half-baked and this backpacker. I still think the backpacker's in the jungle somewhere. Should I check that bridge? That seems like a good place for someone. No, that's probably an escape route. Hmm... Hmm. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to scope out the jungle a little bit more. I'm going to take a slight detour and get that other guard's clothing up there. If he's still up there anyway. Yes, I'm the Taita. Come on, let me alone. I'm trying to get my job done. Oh, the guy's gone. Sort of weird medicine man running around. Where's that key at? There it is. It's probably be my escape route. It, absolutely. All you gotta do is not fall and you'll be fine. I like your Arnold line, sir. It's great. that frog I bet the frog I bet it's poisonous and put the frog in something and they super die okay so that led nowhere hmm 
Hmm. Well, since I'm a guard, I could try and get into the compound and just kill him the old-fashioned way. What's that? Barrel. Chest. Well, let's go scope it out. How do I get over there? Hmm. I have a feeling these could be used as a distraction. Hmm. How do I get that? Sometimes that could be pretty clever. Let's go scoop that out. It could be anything. What's this? circuit board. Hmm. Nah, I'm too stupid. Can't figure it out. Yo, you guys need to hydrate. Hydrate. Oh, this poisonous ones. Okay. Like my uh, viewer here instructed me to poison that guy. Okay. Oh, wait. Did I drop my. Uh... Where is it? Oh, there's my Ingramactin. Ingramactin esque. Somehow this reminds me of the, uh, ju well, the jungle map from GoldenEye. That was cool. Okay, so this leads nowhere, really. This also kind of leads nowhere. I'm not allowed in here. I need a specialized guard outfit. I'm sure one of these gentlemen will be happy to give give me one. Hey. Throw the frog at him. So, it sounds like the Delgado's helicopter pilot dropped a package over the jungle by mistake. A red box containing circuit boards for Jorge Franco's new cocaine processing machine. Hmm. Sounds like a workplace accident. Okay, let's do it. Can anyone see these guys from where I'm at? Try and quick shoot him. Hmm. Let's let them try and walk away. Damn it, they're not moving. Okay. okay this is better.
Damn it. I'm an idiot. Okay. That is Jorge Franco, the Delgado Cartel's chief chemist. How can someone see me through my, my curtains somewhere in here? It's probably because everyone's all upset. Ugh. Okay. Things are winding down. Let's get in there. Oh shit. Disguise yourself as a drug, a drug, drug lab worker, okay? Hmm. Well, let's grab some. What do you say? Yeah, I see the camera. Shut up. Let's see, what are my options here? Ooh, I can start this in generator. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay. Okay, I don't think anyone's gonna be able to see him when I choke his ass out and put him in that container. Or anything. I can't beat him to death with a meaty bone either. That's stupid. Alright, that went well. Let's save. Get some progress. Good show, Ferguson. Time to bring Franco down to size. Bring Franco here. Where is he anyway? <gasps> Look at that! It runs again. Look at how smoothly it's running. This will change everything. Everything. We are suddenly overcome with joy. See, this is what happens when focus is applied alongside. Oh man, it's Stan Lee. He just died, and here he is. Future, so you know, a, a drugged up Steve Stan Lee. What? Why are they still standing here? Surely they can see the machine is working perfectly now. We have no need for them anymore. They are excused to go back home to their sad little lives in the village. That is all. Guard, please escort these people from the I think I'm going to dump them into that section right there. Sorry, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Don't worry, I'm out of here. I'm leaving. Yep, see here he's gonna go. Here you go. Expertly done. Let's get the hell out of here. All targets neutralized. This should paralyze the cartel. Excellent work, 47. Damn, now I'm go good. Yes. Sorry, I'm out of here. Ooh. Let's 
grab this too. All right. Um, I believe I stole that car key, so I'll go ahead and use that. Get out of here. I'm gonna drive right over this guy, hold on. Yeah, perfect. Okay, cool. What do we get? Ah, it's pretty good. Village construction building, fish and village, hostel. Fragmentation grenade. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. What are these? Okay, those are going to be useful in later missions. And those will, too. Excellent, excellent. Wow, I almost got all of them. Okay, well, uh, no, we're not doing that one right now. Sierra Skirt. Successful. Tactical targets neutralized. Militia transport network disabled. Location of primary target unknown. Team chasing several leads. End message. Encrypt and send. She's like an anti-M. Love her. She's great. Or anti-money penny. Those bastards killed 80 people. <laughs> Sounds like one of my operations. Think about what that means. No one's untouchable. No one's untouchable. Diana! Coming! This is pretty cool, they're giving her a lot of backstory here. Oh, oh. Damn.
That was cool. Take it to menu real quick. Man, I'm coming for your ass, Sean Bean. You know I am. I want to see what other kind of cool stuff I can get with Masteries. I already have those all finished. Let's see. Flash of grenades are pretty useful. Sniper. Okay, the ducky's actually really good. that's going to be a stream for right now i'm going to um uh take a break and i might be back later tonight we will see thanks for everyone for joining me um this game is a lot of fun and i look forward to playing it more